guys, this is Val from Val K Inc. and today we're going to be talking about some pickups from the latest discotheque sale at Right Stuff Anime. So just jumping into it, I definitely wanted to pick up Go Shogun, the time it tried And I don't know, I've, I've had a lot of people tell me to go watch this movie. This is a movie based uh, after the TV show, and I was told that you don't really need to see the TV show to enjoy this movie. So why not? I decided to pick it up. This movie is really famous for that one gif of a young girl beating the teeth out of a bunch of boys. So I look forward to seeing that. But yeah, she's basically a mech pilot that is going to a reunion and then suffers an accident and she ends up between like real life and dreams. So I'm really interested to see this one. I don't know anything else about it. <laughs> Just that. Next up on my pickups, I also got, oh, this classic. This is uh, Little Norse Prince Horus, Prince of the Sun. I swear, I swear to you, I saw this on TV when I was a small, small child. It was on some international channel, and I fell in love with this movie. I thought it was so cool. I tried explaining it, <laughs> I think, to my parents, and they were like, we have no idea what you're talking about. Here's a Disney movie. But I definitely wanted to see this again. This, of course, is from Isio Takahara, who is from Studio Ghibli. Oh my god, love him. So, definitely wanted to watch this again and make sure it's what I'm thinking it is. I'm pretty sure it is. After that, I picked up Jungle Emperor Leo. I've never seen this in my life. This is one of those that I've always wanted to see. Of course, Osama Tezuka. Goodness, I love a lot of Tezuka stuff. So I just wanted to see this one. And I really love the disc art. I think it looks great. And I really like this back art. Like, that's just so cute. <laughs> it's just so pleasant. So, I was, th this was my main thing to pick up from the sale. You know, just this discotheque sale was just picking up a lot of the uh, Blu rays that I've always, always wanted. Speaking of which, uh, I've always wanted to own Lupin the Third, uh, the castle of Kagas Litro. I did not say that right, but um, this is considered a Lupin classic, and I haven't seen it. So I really wanted to just get this one, get it in my collection, actually see it. It has really cool disc art, really cool art all around. Uh, if you've never seen any Lupin stuff, um, go watch any Lupin stuff. It's just great. It's just a fun, fun uh, caper, thief, uh, cops and robbers type series. So he's just charming. <laughs> And last but not least, one of my personal favorites. Everyone always asks, what is the first anime you ever watched? This. I watched this. I think I was like six or seven years old. I don't remember. But uh, I watched Samurai Pizza Cats when I was very young. And I actually got to re-watching some episodes just online a couple of years ago. And it's still fun. It's just really crazy and over the top. And it's one of these that opens. It's just cute. Like, it, it's just that kind of funny humor that I like. It's just those cute designs that I like. Mech stuff, cat stuff. It's wonderful. This art is awesome, I just noticed. Let's pull that out. Yeah, Samurai Pizza Cats. I love this show. I have a couple of the original production cells in my cell collection, so it just felt appropriate to finally pick this up and rewatch the series again. That is it for this one. So you guys tell me what is your favorite? Did you guys pick up anything out of the discotheque sale? Do you guys like the discotheque titles? I'm always a big fan because they try to pull older animation and I just love, love that. And getting it on Blu-ray to see it in a better quality is just amazing. So I definitely hope they do another one. I honestly would have bought way more titles if I could afford it, probably the whole line, because I love discotheque. Anyway, that is it for this one. Hi to all my subscribers, you guys rock, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys!